Hey yo, it's Tuesday, December 1st in the evening. Um, trying to think of anything. Nothing's really happened. We're, I think, going up to level two, but it doesn't super affect me. I don't, I don't really do much. Um, although this weekend was a little bit more. Um, part of level two and level 1.5, which we're currently at, means that uh, cafes are takeout only. Restaurants, however, are sit down until 9 p.m. So um, on Thursday, Sunday, Sunday, on Sunday, Anna and I had a meeting about, well, it was intended to be a meeting about Hanukkah, ended up being about a bunch of things. We got a lot done, it was pretty great. Um, and we were going to meet in her office, which is a cold, bare, and inconvenient location for both of us, but it's an HBC, and we were like, oh, like, let's grab some coffee to go to sit with in your office, and then we realized there's a cafe that serves food there that is officially a restaurant, and so we were able to sit, which was nice. It was completely empty, which was great. Um, so that was Sunday, and then it's almost across the street from Misha's. So I went over there. I haven't seen her in months. Um, it's nice to be able to, like, go out and see people and not feel guilty about it. Um, they, I'm, like, the only person they've seen, and they were like, yeah, we know that we're the only people you've seen also. I was like, that's true, I uh, I just moved. I haven't, haven't seen anyone. Um, I was feeling vaguely guilty that, not guilty, but like disappointed, I guess, that yet again, I've moved just before Christmas, which means, you know, one thing I like to do is, because people can't really get decent baked goods here, and I like baking, is to bake giant baskets of cookies and stuff for everybody for Christmas, but the last two years and whoops, maybe not the year before, but the year before that, um, we're moving Christmases or winters. And so I was not set up or organized enough to get as much done in advance as I need to. But uh, I've been finding what's been popping up and I can't tell if they're more prevalent now, or if I just know the right people on Facebook now, but I follow all these various people who take cooking orders out of their homes. So for example, um, one I follow is Indian food, and she makes it to your specification. So I'm like, I want, you know, this many orders of these different things, and please make them not spicy. And they're flavorful and delicious and really inexpensive for the amount of food it is, and it gets delivered right to your house, which is so convenient. Um, so one person, one woman does fudge, uh, fudge delivery. And so we worked out a deal. I'm just ordering little mixed boxes of fudge for everyone for Christmas. Um, very convenient, very efficient. For Hanukkah, Anna and I are going this Saturday, actually, after sundown. And we're gonna film the lighting of the candles for all eight nights. Um, we're cheating, we just, there's no way around it. So we're gonna film all eight nights and we're going to um, do the blessings in English and Hebrew and Korean and explain them in Korean, um, what we're doing and why we're doing and how we're doing. And we're gonna add subtitles and a how-to guide and then, so we need to get started considerably in advance. We can't just do a live thing every night because I'm working most evenings when it's time. Um, so this Saturday we're, I'm going to her place and I'm just bringing a stack of shirts with me so we can pretend that we filmed it on eight different nights. Um, and then other Anna is doing yoga for each morning. I don't really know why, but they'll figure something out. Um, 
yeah, nothing, nothing otherwise particularly exciting in my life. I've been crafting to meet deadlines. I have a couple different gift exchanges that I'm crafting for, and Jisun's nephew had a knitted doll that was, I mean, it's been repaired dozens of times, I think. And finally, he was convinced to let it be repaired one more time. The entire back of the doll was missing. So I'm knitting a new back for the doll, which is harder because it was badly repaired every other time, not by a knitter, but by someone sewing things together. And so now I'm trying to knit into sewing and it's a pain in the ass at best, but whatever, I'm almost finished. Um, yeah, that's about it. It was nice to see you guys all last week and I hope we can do it again. Maybe we'll do it for Hanukkah and I'm gonna head off now.